In our series on understanding international organizations, today we will be discussing IFAD. The International Fund for Agricultural Development, also called IFAD, is an international financial institution and a specialized agency of the United Nations. It is the only multilateral development organization that focuses solely on rural economies and food security. IFAD was established as an international financial institution in 1977 through United Nations General Assembly Resolution as one of the major outcomes of the 1974 World Food Conference. Headquartered in Rome, IFAD is involved in over 200 projects across nearly 100 countries. IFAD has 177 member states and works in partnership with OPEC and OECD members to address poverty and hunger in rural areas of developing countries. It funds and sponsors initiatives that improves land and water management, develop rural infrastructure, train and educate farmers in more efficient technologies, build up resilience against climate change, and enhancing market accessibility. While IFAD has made significant strides in promoting sustainable agricultural development and improving the lives of smallholder farmers, there are still some challenges and criticisms associated with its work. Here are a few key issues. Funding challenges as it relies on voluntary contributions from donor countries to finance its operations which is insufficient to meet growing demand for IFAD's services. 2. Limited reach. While IFAD works in over 100 countries, there are still many areas where it has not been able to establish a presence due to political instability, conflict, etc. Gender inequality. Women make up a large proportion of smallholder farmers, yet they often face significant barriers to accessing resources and services. IFAD has made efforts to address this issue through specific programs but the progress is slow and still a long way to go. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.